we are all aware of the decimal system in decimal system it is a base 10 because we use 10 fingers today we will be discussing one more number system called as sexagesimal so sexagesimal the base is going to be 60 and we will discuss why is it going to be the 60 for the base so sexagesimal you can consider as more mathematical one which is easier for multiplication division and when you want to express in terms of fractions so if you want to divide or express something as fractions you need to make sure that it is composable or you have the multiplications which are easy and considering the base numbers as 1 2 3 4 5 we need to make sure that we have a number which will be easily divisible by all these five numbers that we use for counting so here you can see that we have 1 2 3 4 5 and 2 and 4 you can see that they have like common factors so if something is divisible by 4 it is also divisible by 2 so you can cross out 2 so 1 into 3 into 4 into 5 is going to be the base that we need 3 into 4 is 12 12 into 5 is going to be 60 so this is the reason that we have the base 60 so now you can break this 60 into if you want to break it into two parts you have 2 into 30 if you want to break it into three parts you have 3 into 20 if you want to break it into four parts you have 4 into 15 and if you want to break it into five parts you have 5 into 12 which is going to be 60 sexagesimal numbers are actively used in two things one is angles and the other one is time so in the next video we will discuss how the sexagesimal system is connected to time and angles for that we will be comparing it to uh, equilateral triangles and how it is related to the circle and the 60.